everybody, welcome to Final Draft Picks. Uh, it might be a little loud because I am chilling out in the cooler at Final Draft. Uh, I am going to be talking about some of the beers we had on tap. Four Peaks Brewing Company. They're out in Tempe, Arizona. Um, we have four of the beers on tap. We used to have five, but we already blew one of them. So let's just get started. It's nice and chilly in here, so it's a hot day. These beers are lovely. Um, there's only one of these beers that's over 7%, so it's not like you're going to get super drunk or anything like that, but they're just great tasting beers. Um, the first one, you can find these in cans sometimes around the store. It's nice and clear. It's light. It's their Peach Golden Ale. Um, uh, you get a good, nice whip. You get a lot of those peach skins. Um, not so much like the sweet peach like in the little fruity cups, but let's have a taste. Delicious. 
I'd get a fan of this one definitely out of those two. And the last one. The last one, this is the one I've seen since I've been drinking beer, which I'm 31, so I've been drinking beer for a while. This is one beer I've always seen at the stores. Um, it's the Kilt Lifter. I know they started selling the cans now too, which is great. Uh, it's a Scottish export ale, so it's gonna be a lot of roasts, toasty notes to it, a little sweetness, um, maybe a little bit of smoke from the roasted malts, but it, it's an award-winning beer. They've been producing it forever. It's delicious. It's 6%. Um, really low on IBUs. The IBUs are just going to be like the bitterness to it. So if you like a dark beer, nothing like a stout, but something a little bit lighter than that, this would be a great beer to have. Let's go ahead and have a, a little whip. Definitely get a little roast malt character to it, which I miss malt a little bit. Everybody just makes a lot of hops, but I do miss malt. So it's good to have some that has a nice malt backbone to it. And it's, it has a nice malt sweetness to it, and nice roast notes to it. If you like, if you're someone that likes an ESB, a little bit more of a body bite, roasted notes, and a little bit smoke, a little bit smoke in this. They would love this beer. Um, if you have friends that are not really the hoppy beers, try to give them this one. This might be a good fit to your style, especially if they like malt, baking, even some like timber types of bread. This would be a great one to have. Super loud in here, but it's nice and chilly, keeping all the kegs we have in here pretty cold. Um, yeah, like I said, this is a great beer to have. Especially if you're kind of hot now. I know right now craft beer is 20 different IPAs or pails that still fit the IPA category, so it's kind of fun to have something that's malty. Um, if you don't follow us on Instagram or Facebook, or don't get our newsletters, we're doing, I believe this Sunday, we're doing like a rib potluck. Rib cook-off slash barbecue potluck. You know, I'm sure a lot of you have noticed that there's rib cook-off coming up, but sometimes it's a pain in the butt to get down there. Um, especially when maybe it might be like 95 degrees, and you don't want to wait in line and sit on a curb to try to eat a rib and end up dropping it. You just dropped like $4 worth of ribs. So come on down to Final Draft, look us up. Uh, we're doing a little rib cook-off slash uh, potluck. We're gonna have some beers on tap too, just for the event. Definitely check out the other local brew pubs because we want to support everybody. We know that craft beer makes happy people and you know we're family friendly too, so come on down. Uh, if there's anything you're interested in, let us know. If there's any beers you want us to try, uh, myself, Shelby was busy over there. I uh, can't see, but behind that is taps. Um, we definitely have to try out some new stuff. So let us know if anything you want. Have a great, happy Sunday, and have a great poll next week. Third week of school for a lot of kids. So in other words, a lot of parents are going through the stress and the grind of getting their kids ready. But I totally understand. Okay. So have a good week. Happy draft picks. Happy beer.